I'm Matt Pennell. I'm an evolutionary biologist here at UBC. I got my start in biology studying birds in the Nuvik Northwest Territories. The goal of my research is to improve in some small way our understanding of why we see such a tremendous diversity in, in genomes. There's multiple ways to study evolution, and one of the ways people look at it is look at it within populations. And so there's a number of forces which cause change within populations, such as natural selection or mutations. Then there's the other way of studying evolution, which is looking at the really big picture. And going out in the world and being like, wow, there's you know, 9,000 different species of birds. So we see this huge, large-scale diversity. And so what we want to do as biologists, as evolution biologists, is try to understand how these nitty-gritty processes operating within populations over long, long time periods build up to create this whole diversity. Where does all this diversity come from? It's a very fundamental question. I realized that I really needed some kind of statistical tools to, to answer the questions because the data was very big and hard to handle and some sophisticated analysis needed to be done. So I started learning how to do some coding. I started learning a bit of math and a bit of statistics. And now my research program has completely transitioned to being primarily computational. I'm a very unconventional biologist and I feel silly telling people I'm a biologist because I spend all my day in front of the computer. This is a way to do biology. This is a way to think about biology. And if you're gonna look at these really large scale patterns, uh, you need to use computers. I feel incredibly grateful for the Killam Award. I think it's such a cool opportunity to come here to UBC to spend two years just focusing on what I want to do and not be distracted by other obligations um, or projects for other people, but to really just dig deep and develop as a scientist and an independent re researcher, independent thinker.